All right, well, this is my uh, latest addition to the X2 mill. I've been real busy doing other things, so I haven't really done anything uh, extra to the mill except use it. But I wanted to add a, a way to blow the chips away from the workpiece and the tool path. So I had to make a, an adapter block. I just bolted right to the X2 mill in the uh, stock OEM holes that was used for the fine adjustment for the z-axis speed. I uh, picked this uh, flexible hose up off of um, eBay and I've got a quick connect coupling here with some quarter inch air line and I'm just going to be using air at the moment and I didn't want to use my big compressor because I didn't want it to I just didn't want the, all the extra noise so I've got a little airbrush compressor that puts out about 50 I think it's 57 58 psi and it just blows a little little bit of air on there just enough to keep the chips away from the tool bit and it works really well of course this is adjustable and it's got a valve here I've got it cracked uh, just enough to give it just a little bit of pressure. It's probably blowing around 10 psi, something like that. But it worked. It, it, so far, it's working real well to keep um, keep the chips off the tool bit. And we'll see. So the airline, as you can see, it feeds through here, and then goes to a a little airbrush compressor here that I have hooked up at the bottom and uh, seems to work real well so far so we'll just have to see how it does uh, in the future also I was thinking maybe if I added a mist to it later on it would be just enough to give it a just a fine mist we'll have to see um, I've seen people use pond air pumps I don't know how many CFM those put out. Um, it may be better than this setup, I'm not sure, but you use what you have, and this was real quiet. I don't have to listen to it, and it just blows air. So thanks for watching the videos. Uh, I'm going to try to uh, install some home switches next, and uh, I've been running it without them. It runs fine without them. It's just... Uh, a lot easier if you have them to find your reference your uh, homes but that's uh, that's where we're at now so basically just had to make this little block using uh, the two stock bolt locations and just mounted it right there it works fine and it uh, seems to be doing a good job so thanks for watching the video Please subscribe to the YouTube channel and uh, until next time.